Members of the lay NHC Tenants Voice Incorporation presented the petition in April this year to the Housing Minister through lay MP John Russell. The petition had 10 points regarding housing issues. Chairman of the association, Dick Karim, said only one point in the petition was addressed. Mr. Karim claimed the association is yet to get a response in black and white from the housing minister. The only item out of the 10 that was action was the two offices in Lee were suspended. And as to when uh, the other nine will be responded to is the query that the members are still asking. The points in the petition were listed in order of agency for action, beginning with the call to stop all evictions in lay. Points two and three were for transfer of titles to long-term tenants and review into illegal evictions of past long-term sitting tenants. Mr. Karim said NHE tenants in lay are still getting eviction notices. And then these evictions, we don't know whether it's coming out of lay or from Mosby, but uh, we know that the two offices in Leia are suspended and how these eviction notices are coming in, you know, that's another question. For many families, illegal battles with the NHC over illegal evictions have been costly and stressful. Late Levi Kurakipa, a senior court sheriff in Lay, was a victim of NHC evictions who was vocal about NHC issues. Last month, he passed on. Late Levi was one of the senior public servants. And then when he was evicted, he was not given any alternative place to stay. So as a result, he was a sick man and he was forced to go and live at the, at the settlement. And then that also led to the sudden pass on, passing on of Levy. The group hopes to be the voice for people like late Kura Kipa and many others who have gone through the same Charlene Airy, National MTV News, Lee.